Hi guys, today I'll be talking about this van. I'll be taking off the bumper. I just need to fix this little dent. So I'll be taking it off. First, what you wanna do is take this plastic, plastic cover off so it's out of your way. I already took mine off, except that I clipped it on one. The best way to probably take it off is you use a special tool and uh, like for the clips and sometimes they break off these right here like the like clips or whatever they are maybe the best thing to do is probably go from the inside and just press them press them like with either pliers or something and then come off because when you just pry it sometimes they break but i didn't really care about mine because mine's cracked, I'm replacing mine either way. So I just pulled it. But to do it carefully, you probably want to do is lightly pry it. And then from the inside, take like a, some kind of pliers or something to squeeze them maybe and take it off. That's the best thing I can probably suggest. But I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, let's get started. So this is the tool I was using to pry it. But like I said, be careful. If you want to save this piece, make sure you pinch it from the inside. Under the bumper, you have to go inside, probably pinch it with the pliers and then pry it lightly. Some of it, it works just like that. If you just gently pry it. And I have one left. But yeah, you can still break it. So I would suggest just this one worked. There might be another way to just take the bumper off maybe and then use your access to take this off or maybe you don't even have to take this off but since i need to replace this i'm taking mine off so these are the clips i was talking about they're not really clips but they're maybe you can squeeze it from the inside and then pull it out but i broke some of mine so, so to take the bumper off <clears throat> the easier way so you don't have to take a lot of bolts out there should be like four bolts two short ones two long ones one on this side right in here i don't know if you can see it it's right in there this one right here that holds by right here this part and the one on the other side as well so i believe it's a 15 millimeter So then you can, what you want to do is, there's two bolts inside, one here and one here. If you look right in there, and there it is. It's what I noticed what works. The size, I got 13 sixteenths. Not sure what, what it is in metric, but it's 13 sixteenths. Does fit, that's what I have and that's what I'm gonna use. So I'm loosening this one and one more on that side. And I think that should be it for to take the bumper off. Just make sure you have a second hand just in case it's heavy. Once you took those two bolts off, the big ones and two small ones, total of four, you can just pull on this carefully. 
and that comes off. So I already took off my bumper and I fixed some stuff that I needed to fix. So to put it back, same way how you took it off, there's big bolts. They go one bolt here, one here, and the screws in in the bottom. I'll show you the bumper. When you this is the bottom. So when you're screwing it in, it screws in from here to here. And same one goes here as well. I have it somewhere. So that's all you do, just those two bolts and then two more on the side. One right here and one right here. And that's all you need for the bumper if that's how you took it off. So thank you for watching. Please consider subscribing if you're not subscribed yet. I'll have more different content coming. And I'll do a review on this van. I have more content on this van if you need to know how to re replace the... I replaced the passenger side. That, uh, the whole panel. Also, I replaced the door handle. I have videos on my channel, so if you want to watch how to do that you're welcome to so yeah that'll be it for this one thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one